Alright guys, so it's been a lazy morning. It's probably actually the first time we've spent half the day just laying around in the van, or at least I have. Normally Taylor's the one laying down, chilling, <laughs> and I'm the one around doing stuff, but it's been opposite today, which was really nice. But now we've got the bed folded up. We're driven outside the library and we're actually starting lunch, I'll show you. I've just made a start on this sweet potato. We've got four cups of white rice and I'm gonna cut that up. And that's gonna end up in there, about eight and a half cups of water and then cook it out on the propane stove. Hey guys, so I got Matt a birthday present for his birthday coming up in a few weeks. It's coming early though, it's coming today, so we're gonna go to the post office and pick it up later, but he doesn't know what it is, so I'm excited to give it to him. So Matt usually cooks with this on the ground, but I like cooking with it in the van and just having the doors wide open so I don't have to bend over and everything. But Maddie usually doesn't like it because the fumes get in the van, which I get too. But he's going in the library, so he just moved it up for me. So I'm going to look after the lunch. Maddie's going to go into the library, and when it's done, I'm going to sneak it in and we're going to eat in there together and get some work done. Maddie's just doing some dishes now. This is how we do it with our two spray bottle system. Works decently for us. I don't really know how else you do it with a tiny van. These chopping boards are great too. They're real thin ones. Easy to store. And they look really good on the bench. They take up no space. Yeah. Way better than our old thick cutting board. Yeah. Then we just hide it up. up there. Slips in easy. That's what she said. Lunch is done. We got rice with sweet potatoes. We're gonna dress it up with some sauces and spices. Should be yummy. We've come back out to have some lunch. The library closed up at two for an hour. It's a COVID thing. We decided to eat out here. We were a bit paranoid. I don't think you're supposed to eat in the library and we couldn't find a good spot to get away with it. And so, yeah, it's two o'clock. We had to go hungry for a while. And the security guard is pretty vigilant. Yeah, he's onto it. He's always telling me off for having no shoes and no mask on. So we have a problem. The post office closes at 2 today and it's closed tomorrow because it's Sunday. So Matt's not getting his present till Monday. We missed it. It's 3 o'clock. <laughs> yeah, we missed it. Damn it. Okay, so like Taylor said, we can't go to the post office now. It's after 2. It's closed. So we're probably just going to hit the library again. Getting a bit repetitive here, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we want to leave and we want to head south. I mean, you can see why the weather's not that great. We are still waiting for our solar panel, but it's supposed to have been delivered today. We haven't heard about it, but we'll probably be putting that on in the next few days. And once we do that, and once we pick up what Taylor has at the post office, we're heading out of here. So yeah, wait for that. A few vlogs time, hopefully we'll be seeing some new interesting stuff. Hey Taylor. Yes, I want warmer weather. I want to mix it up and see some new things. Yeah. So we have these propane bottles. We're starting to collect a few empty ones. These are all empty, this one's not. We don't really know what to do with them. We don't want to throw them away, we want to recycle them. We worked out one place we can do it, but it's probably an hour north from here. So if anyone knows, like it's a shop or a camping store or something that takes these, let us know. All right guys, so this here, it's one of our back doors. At the moment, we don't really use any of the real estate, but what we're thinking is either around about here or maybe here, putting a fold-out shelf. So we already have one fold-out shelf in here, this one here, you know, can fold down. But we're thinking, usually when we cook with the propane, or at least when I do, I cook outside. But if we had a fold-out shelf here, we could have it set up, you know, and have it be up off the ground, so we're not having to bend over, and it would look nicer as well. And just looking at it, when that's closed, a bit dark but there should be enough space for that to fit and then we're also thinking if we instead of putting it lower we put it up higher we could actually fit it in a way that you could have it opened and then close the door and then actually have it be a little shelf to put your laptop on or something when you're watching a movie and we could watch the movie from like you know the end over there where Taylor is back towards this way so that's sort of a few ideas we've had do you guys ever feel like it's just not your day? Like you haven't had a shower and you feel gross and your skin is breaking out because you're on your period and you live in a van and it's cold. <laughs>
and you gotta wait for the post to come so you have to keep checking at the post office for your mail to come <laughs> and you just want to shower and you just want to cuddle in temperature controlled house and you want your acne to go away and you've been eating plant-based but it's still not enough because of reasons and yeah, that's kind of how I feel today so just putting on a little makeup to make me feel a little better. And I wanted to make some nursing videos talking about different classes. So give me a follow on my channel. I'm going to be making videos too. Just kind of talking about veganism, nursing, and van life stuff. They're not going to be pro like Matt's videos, but it'll just be like little videos of me talking. So if you're interested, just give me a follow. This stuff is awesome. It's tart and it's cruelty free vegan and it's also oil free. So if you're acne prone, it's a very nice foundation. Wow, guys, I put on makeup. I changed my shirt and I'm feeling like a whole new person. I recorded a video about nursing school. I'm feeling loads better, so this is just the turn in the day that I needed to make myself be a little bit better <laughs> about everything. All right, guys, so we finally left the library. We've made it to the gym, got our gear, ready to do a bit of a workout. I'm going to work on my strength in my calf. And Taylor, you're probably going to do some weights, yeah? Yeah, weights. Taylor wants to get swole, <laughs> and I want to be able to start running again. It's swole patrol time. This is a 24-hour one as well. Guys, I've got a pro tip for you. Don't forget your lock. And you your pants are no good as a mask. You need to wear a mask. Hey guys, so we're the last ones in Planet Fitness. Didn't even realize it closed. We thought it was 24 hours. I came out of the shower and it was just empty. And I went up to the guy and I was like, what's going on? And he's like, we closed 20 minutes ago, man. I was like, oh. I was like, is my girlfriend still in here? And he said, I don't think so. And he's like, I better go check. And Taylor was still in the shower too. <laughs> he probably would have locked us in. So guys, Dollar Tree has the Hunt's traditional sauce and the garlic and herb for a dollar each, which is almost half what we pay at the supermarket. So I got 10 of them, but I didn't want plastic bags. I couldn't fit it. Oh no! Guys, we've got a problem. I'm gonna show you. Can you hear that? That van over there? Mate, they stole our spot. We always park where that hedge is on that side because it blocks the wind. And to throw salt in the wounds, they've got a generator going and we can hear it from this spot, which is the only other good spot with this half hedge. Can you believe that? I just, I don't even know. All right, pasta tonight. Taylor's just throwing a bit of nutritional yeast on there. It's gonna be pretty good. Now we're gonna just chill and watch a drug documentary. <laughs> we normally watch stuff on Taylor's phone because she has unlimited data. That's one thing we're still trying to work out. Uh, how to get like unlimited hotspot. That would be sick. Yeah. If you know how to do it, let us know. <clears throat> let us know what the good phone plans are for hotspot. I've got AT&T right now, but it seems like it could be better. I don't know. Hey guys, so thanks for watching another vlog. Hope you enjoyed it. If you've got any questions, just leave a comment or anything you want to see in the vlogs, let us know. Remember to give it a thumbs up and remember to subscribe. Thanks for watching. And make fun of Matt in the comments for dropping all that pasta. <laughs>